Hey friends, I'm making some thumbnails for derelict spaceship culture. I've set up a mood board with things like abandoned factory parts and old boats and whatnot. I'm mostly using a fill layer, which is a single color. And when you're on a fill layer, you can draw with white and erase with black. So I just hit X to have a single tool for everything. And that means your eraser and your brush are the same tool. I've set up a brush puck that has the shapes fill brush and several inking brushes where their results are always very hard and symmetrical. The shapes fill brush is my favorite though and this means that I can paint in silhouettes and then every once in a while switch brushes if I just need to add a few insect-like legs or draw details in. I sometimes turn the symmetry draw on and off and reset it so that I can draw and a single place and the left and right will be the same but I toggle it off every once in a while so I can add asymmetrical details like stuff on the roof or stuff off to one side. I oftentimes use the difference blend mode and this will mean that if you're painting with white uh, if you're already on white it will subtract so and this means I don't even need to erase I oftentimes just stay on difference mode and do everything all at once. Lastly, I oftentimes use shape tools like switching to the line tool. You can do that in Creative by holding V down. Or if I need to draw explicit shapes, I'll use the circle and square tool. I do a couple of shapes just with the square tool to see it in silhouette as basic as possible. And then I even sometimes use the distort brushes so that I can move them around and start from straight squares and then just make it a little more organic. Anyways, hope this helps you with your thumbnailing.